Hello and welcome to episode 11 of the series. Uh, and if you watched the last episode, you see I built, I started the build. And it's been around, f what, uh, 13 to 15 hours since I recorded the last video. Uh, so I've got, I've restocked and all the, br uh, I got like a shulker box of every brick type and a shulker box of, uh, of spruce. And I also got a shulker box of assorted materials. This, this took me the longest. And... I don't think I talked about it in this last episode, but this is going to be like an observ observatory. Ob they use it to look at the stars and stuff. That's what this tower is going to be. Um, and I, I still have to decorate the entire inside of my base, so I'm going to also try to do it th that this episode. Uh, but we should probably start, so I'm going to start right about now. Okay, now, you may have realized that there was a slight cut from me building it to it being finished. Yeah, that's because I didn't, I, the recording crashed, so I didn't record, like, three hours of work. So, here, here I'm going to give you a recap, but first, uh, let me sleep. But yeah, it's going to be in my bedroom. Ugh. Just frustrated that the recording crashed, because... That was a lot of work, but yeah, so I built, like, a system to find out where the sun is, and maybe later I'll add, like, a sign saying what time it is and all that. So I could use it like a clock. Oh, and I also... I practically just finished this tower. Because I also built the steps down. So, yeah, um... I think it's, it's a... It's a weird-looking object. Obs... Ob the tor ob ob the observator. I can't pronounce it. You know what I mean. It's like things that scientists used to look at stars and all that. Yeah, so I built one of those. Now, usually the uh like the spyglass part is put on the on like this axis. Except I didn't feel like doing that because I wanted to be able to look through it. So it sort of works. Oh. I have to light this area up, though, probably. Okay, but either way, I better get back to building.
Okay, so in that time lapse, you saw me finish off the build. Uh, but also, um, two, th three things actually happened while working on this build. Uh, one, I got a job. So, you know, it's gonna be fun. I'm gonna be able to start making money. Uh, two, got a new headphone. So, I, I'm just trying out the audio here. I believe it's good. I tested it multiple times, it works. But, just to be safe. And three, I can now say obs of, obs. I can't find it. I, I swear I had it. Observatory. That's stuff. That's how you say it, yeah. Okay, well, so I'm gonna give a tour of the base. Here's the main tower of, uh, and also the main part of the building where I sleep. Um, I'm actually gonna fly up there real quick. Because I, I didn't change much on the, uh, the exterior, to be honest. Okay, so, the bed, ender chest, spare shulker, uh, you know, this is the main area. Then we go down to the second floor inside the tower, because that's the bottom. Uh, the second floor re is the, like, the top area. I'm still thinking of what I could do here to make the lights look less obvious. If anyone has any ideas, I also need ideas for a couple of rooms that are still empty. Uh, here's like the refinery. There's some stuff that fell off and the chains broke off. Uh, cauldrons are filled to the brim with lava, so you know, that's cool. Not a health violation or anything like that, obviously. Down this hallway is the furnace room, which just has lots of furnaces. That's it. Uh, this is the room that I don't know what to do. It's like an L shape. Uh, again, any ideas would be amazing. Um, let's see here. Bathroom. Uh, very simple right now, but I'm planning on adding more stuff. Here's a toilet. Uh, let's see here. Let's continue down the hallway. Right here, I don't have a door yet, but here's my horse that I brought over. In, oh, that's not what I pressed at all. There we go. But yeah, so this is like a garage, kind of. Um, what else? What else? Um, here is gonna be some essential villagers, like, not the- I'm not moving the ones from my old base, because that'll take way too long, so instead of here are some zombie villages, probably. Then over here is gonna be my library, which still needs more books, and my potato area. I also built the infinite water source right here. I'm gonna eventually make a door to hide it, but yeah, it's my potato field where I get potatoes, and I'm gonna trade them with villagers. Uh, but yeah, so that's the entire basement, or I guess first floor matters how you look at it. Uh, here's the music room, so you know I have all the music discs that I have extra of. Um, right here is my ch my storage room, and where I'm going to be putting all the tables that I don't know where else to put. Okay. Over here is a tower, which you can, I guess, like, it's a lookout tower that's on top of the garage, so you might build, like, a patio or something. Here's gonna be. I want to build like a prison cell. But that's gonna be the actual basement, which we'll go to at the very end. So I'm still thinking about what to put there. Maybe like a ritual circle for fun. And up here is gonna be my treasure room. So far, I don't have much treasure. I have the stuff I need to finish off the list of stuff that I need to do, and the dragon egg. Uh, the list is over here. So, again, going back to my goals, beat all four bosses, get every armor trim, build a proper mega base, build some beacons, uh, which is going to be an, a full iron beacon, a full gold beacon, and a full uh, emerald beacon, build a farming district, defeat a raid, and a new one I added is Raid a Mansion. Because, why not? And also because I feel like that'd be a really cool th thing to renovate, and now we're back up here. Now to the basement basement, which I'm probably going to be renovating at a later point, because I would like to start working on the other parts of the mega base, because this is just the main building, because I want to build like a little hobbit city down there, 
like a farming, not farming, like like a, like a market over there. And then like normal houses down there and over there. And you know, mate, like a couple bridges, some boats, stuff like that. Down here, here's the actual basement, so... Got to, I'm, I, I want to keep this as like a thing, I just don't have to use, to use it for. Uh, but yeah, here's gonna be the portal area. And just down this hallway, up these stairs, and you also light it up, obviously. I believe there's a prison cell somewhere. And if there isn't, I could build one. Now, there it is. And I'm gonna... I, I can actually start trapping some mobs in here, actually. That'd be fun. There's, like, a bunch of villagers down here. But, yeah, so... That's the whole build. It isn't that big, but also it's just the start of the mega base. And I've already spent two weeks on this build. So I think it should be around time that I start working on other stuff. Because I've posted other videos in between working on this, but... You know, nothing special. Uh, but now I have one more thing to do. Okay, I've just spent the last, like, eight hours building this, and... It doesn't look super impressive until you realize each single one of is a single firework. And this is to celebrate me getting 50 subscribers. So thank you guys so much for that. Um, so yeah, no, I'm, I just, all I have to do is wait for night. So while I'm waiting for night, I guess I'm going to torch the place up. Okay, time to, time to turn on, I guess. Uh, thank you guys for 50 subscribers, and I will be seeing you guys in the next episode. Wow, that is a nice build.